As far as Manchester United fans were concerned, Antoine Griezmann was the number one transfer target this summer. But Atletico Madrid had a transfer ban upheld by the Court of Arbitration this week, which means they cannot sign any players until January 2018. And Antoine Griezmann has now confirmed that he is going to be staying at Atletico Madrid. Speaking to French television's Telefoot, Griezmann said the CAS sanction has been passed. I've decided to stay. It's been another good season and hopefully we can make some good signings in January. It's a tough moment for the club, for my teammates and it would be a low blow for me to leave now. So Griezmann to Manchester United, it was touted as the potential marquee signing of the summer. It's not going to happen. Griezmann is staying at Atletico Madrid. And what, what do I think of it? Uh, I think in a modern day football, I suppose it's kind of nice to see a little bit of loyalty from a player. Griezmann, he's been at Atletico Madrid ever since he joined from Real Sociedad. The fans love him. Atletico Madrid loves him. And clearly Griezmann has got a soft spot for him. For Manchester United fans, we're all going to be frustrated, understandably. Griezmann is one of the best players in the world. I think he came third in the Ballon d'Or the other year behind Ronaldo and Messi. That's how good a player he is. That's how good a player we could have signed. But ultimately, the transfer ban has been the scupper, the, the stopping block for this move. And you can understand it from Griezmann's point of view. He wants to stay at Atletico Madrid because even if they were to sell him for a, a record 100 million euros, they wouldn't be able to spend it. They wouldn't be able to bring in a replacement like Alexandre Lacazette, who they already planned to bring in. So that move's not going to happen. And it does suck for United because ultimately we could have had one of the best players in the world. And weirdly it's worked out for Atletico Madrid that the transfer ban is helping them in the transfer market in some way. They're now holding on to their best player. Because if that transfer ban hadn't have been upheld and had Atletico Madrid been able to buy and sell players, I think we'd be seeing Griezmann in a Manchester United shirt next season. But it's not to be. Something that I do find strange about this whole situation though is, you know... Griezmann's been teasing us, said it was 6 out of 10 to join Manchester United. You saw that Huawei advert where he looked at his watch and saw Jose. He's been talking about how he wants to play alongside Paul Pogba at some time in his career. He's been teasing us and Griezmann's clearly been keeping his options open. And why wouldn't he? He's a football player. He really wants to make sure that he is in the best possible position with as many clubs as possible. But what I find strange about all of this is the fact that Let's be honest, we all knew it was pretty inevitable that Atletico Madrid's transfer ban was going to be upheld. They had nearly 60 serious offences against them in terms of signing under-18s players. I'm not sure what the whole situation is, but I know that they had around about 10 times more than Real Madrid and Barcelona. So Atletico Madrid were pretty much never going to have their transfer ban appeal successful. So they were always going to get it. So Griezmann pretty much always knew he was going to get it. Maybe he's played us... Played us all for a fall. Doesn't really strike me as that sort of character. But yes, Griezmann is staying at Atletico Madrid. We've got absolute confirmation of that. What do you think about the situation? I've seen people calling Griezmann a snake for turning his back on United after teasing us and all this shit. And that is completely not the case because Griezmann has been looking after number one himself. He never said he was going to join Manchester United. He's just fueling the fires. We're all suckers for it. And I would love to see United sign Griezmann, but it's not going to happen this summer. So who would you like to see Man United sign instead of Griezmann? Let me know in the comments below who you think the best alternative is. We've been linked with Bale, he's not really an alternative. Rodriguez, he's not really a direct alternative either. But there are lots and lots of players. So who would you like to see Manchester United sign as the marquee player instead of Antoine Griezmann this summer? Uh, that's it for the reaction to this. Drop a like on the video if you would. Always helps. Uh, subscribe to United People's TV if you're new. And we'll see you soon. Take it easy.